coverage you can count on continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. Hey, and welcome back where we're live downtown at Parkview Field where the Tin Caps opening a four game series against the West Michigan White Caps tonight. 705 is the first pitch. Uh, the Tin Caps in the middle of a nine game homestand, but one guy who's always at home when he's playing at Parkview Field, TJ Weir, pitcher for the Tin Caps, joining me now. TJ, hey, we appreciate it. You're from Kokomo. You played college baseball down the road at Ball State. This is like your backyard relatively to start your professional career. What's it like to play? This early in your career as a pro, so close to home. It's awesome being able to be this close. Um, you know, being at Ball State, I was about an hour away from home, so my parents and friends and family could all come out and watch me. And, and we kind of thought going to pro ball would be a little different, but it ends up working out perfectly. And they've been to every game I've pitched at, so it can't really get much better than this. You're a finance major at Ball State, academic all Mac. I know you're a smart guy. So tell me, what is the thing that has flipped the switch for the Tin Caps? Because up until a couple of one-run losses yesterday, you'd won six of eight, three in a row. Really seemed to have flipped the switch as far as the season has gone. Right, and you mentioned one-run losses, so we played good baseball yesterday too. So um, we just knew it was a matter of time until we turned it around because we've got a lot of good players on this team. Um, some, a lot of guys in their first year first full season of pro ball so we knew it would take a little time but now we got some confidence and we're rolling and pitching the ball a lot better than we get, did at the beginning of the year so we're excited to see where we can go for you what's been the biggest difference transitioning from playing at ball state to playing on the professional level um the game's a lot faster um a lot more games so we play 142 games here compared to about 56 or so in college so um, just getting used to playing every day rather than just playing on the weekends and maybe one one midweek game in college. So that's been the biggest thing. Talk about these jerseys, man. You got the Lego jerseys. I imagine you were a Lego fan growing right. up as a kid, as a yeah. smart guy, right? <laughs> so what's it like to play uh, with kind of all the promotions and all the great things that Mike Limmer and Mike Nutter that these guys do with the Tin Cat? What they do here in Fort Wayne is unbelievable. Just the facilities um, are awesome. But then on top of that, stuff like this and Lego night and we were Captain America jerseys and stuff like that. So. Um, just the whole experience of the baseball atmosphere in Fort Wayne is awesome. All right, TJ, we appreciate it. Continued luck, hopefully, this season for the Tin Caps. That's TJ Weir, pitcher for the Caps and Ball State grad.